What's good, y'all? Rustage, Shabadi, and Connor Quest. Naruto, 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 look at me now. The rap. Bad. I'm changing my fate, I fight for my place against the hate that I make mine Strive to be great but I've made my mistakes lines Marked on my face when I play I get straight nines Lay that foundation, baseline, fox in the night or the daytime Tune in exam to the forest to grave sites Toss to the wayside, straight to the noggin like we do in FaceTime Nine tails when the fire failed, I'm a beast man Blind fail, punch the light braille, you can rehance Wise girl, they couldn't even draw it in the recap Hitting no division, making covers like a beat map Uh, you ain't gonna see that, uh Flex shots, you need feedback, uh Next up, you gon' keep track, uh Checked off with a rematch, uh They wanna say that I won't be the best Happy the reason that Sasuke is depressed Sharing but I'm the one seeing red when I step on the block it becomes an event Could I in my hand even cut to ribbons unforgiven clones given double vision Dumb the mission up like a drug addiction cause I bring more toes to the mushroom kingdom <laughs> Look at me now I've made it know that I've been the greatest Look at me now I'm famous act like a god I'm sacred Look at me now I made it know that I've been the greatest Look at me now I'm famous act like a god I'm sacred Look at me now I've made it know that I've been the greatest Look at me now I'm famous act like a god God, I'm sacred. <laughs> Look at me now, I've made it. Know that I've been the greatest. Look at me now, I'm famous. Act like a god of sacred. <laughs> It's me from the sequel. Yeah. QB unleashed a beast. We're not equal. Yeah. Peace and a feature feast on the evil. Release the seal and defeat the people. Seed on the leaf. I'm reaching my throne. Yeah. Beat after beat. Repeat. I'm the god. Right. Came a long way. I'm facing my goals. Right. Came a long way from playing alone. I will never back down. So back down. Yeah. Took a lot of smack till you get smacked down. Right. I was down bad. Had to put back down. Never had that home. But my home's back now. Uh, I'm really top of my game right now. They be looking for a handout. Yeah. Unless they want to put a band down. Rass against spike my punch. Put a man down. Yeah. Become the seventh. Team on my back. Really willing the seventh. Yeah. Feel like a beacon of villains I besiege your finish and defend the weakest people I speak and teach them a lesson Fewer yeah. discretion yeah. If you're a step and I'll ruin your section They gonna copy me They ain't a you Any attempt is a poor reflection <laughs> Look at me now, I've made it Know that I've been the greatest Look at me now, I'm famous Act like a god, I'm sacred <laughs> Look at me now, I've made it Know that I've been the greatest Look at me now, I'm famous Act like a god, I'm sacred <laughs> From this town, you don't know the first thing about it Work is a mountain Nice ever work is a mountain Well done, doubt and reverse the Routed, they crowded and crowded. Now, if anyone go rowdy maneuvers, they can get them foul like a Zuna. Turn for the pouting loser, shouting in humor to pound in a Hugo. Yeah. Talk to the right, get cocked in your loud jaw. Kurama, I suck him in the south pole. I am on the roof, he get knocked to the ground floor. Wasn't another battle when I've tackled all our walls. Yeah. See his babes always fall for the QB. I till I go join them all in the QB. Rocked on the tip like the truck for the QB. Yeah. Made the first move, then went home like it's QB. Yeah. Blue with Muzi, get the perfect shot, that's a Kubi movie. Oh, I can't see the view from Fuji. The net see me shoot the Thule, bust a two Zuzu sign, then a boogie woogie. Lots of these twice on the top of the chart. Want me to crash, the bollocks to that. Next time you go in and talk and you smack me, your knobs got clapped by Boruto's dad. Look at me now, I've been around, don't put me down, look at me now. Look at me now, look I'm made it, now, know that I've been the greatest. Around, look at me now, I'm famous, act like a god, I'm sacred. Look at me now, I've made it. Know that I've been the greatest. Look at me now, I'm famous. Act like a god, I'm sacred. Look at me now, I've made it. Know that I've been the greatest. Look at me now, I'm famous. Act like a god, I'm sacred. Alright. Yeah, man. Shout out to Rusty, Shabadi, and Connor Quest, man. Y'all did y'all shit. Now for this one, I just wanted to go completely left field, do something completely different. Like, I know y'all getting fatigued of me doing the same artists over and over and over again. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go find something completely random. I'm not listening to no suggestions. I'm not doing none of that shit. I'm about to go just dig and see if I can find something interesting enough that stands out to me. And I think this is it. Now I'm familiar with the Naruto, Nar Naruto. I don't know how you say that shit. I know I'm butchering it, but whatever. That's just me. I butcher shit. Get over it. Word serial killer. You know what I'm talking about? That's me. But I've heard of it before. I got a couple friends that I know that watched the actual series or have watched the series. I don't know if it's still out. I have no idea. Anyways, I think most of what they were rapping about kind of had to do with the series. So I think they were rapping from the perspective of maybe one, two or three characters in the series. And I thought that was pretty dope. It's kind of a nifty creative idea, you know, definitely makes creating a music video a little bit easier. You know what I'm saying? When you already got the clips, you just throw some lyrics over top of that shit. And it came out hot. I really can't hate on it at all. 
all of them were doing their thing. I feel like the second dude was rapping in MLA format. It just sounded so proper and so formal and like, you know, so concise, so clear. My favorite out of the three was the third one. Like, I just feel like he hit a button and he just let that shit go. You know what I'm saying? He was talking about some high yugas and some more shit. Now, I don't even know what the fuck he was talking about, but that shit came out so damn smooth and so damn slick that I had to just, I don't know. Like, it kind of caught me by surprise. I'm like, damn, they rapping about a fucking anime, but this motherfucker spitting. They always spitting, but I just don't know what they was talking about to give the other ones the same amount of credit that I can get the last guy, because the last guy was just going off on a tangent, for real. This also proves to me that it is not about what you what you're rapping about or what you're saying in the actual lyrics sometimes it's that sonic thing again and that's what i mean you know like i didn't really have the feeling so much you know as the song was going through at the beginning because i'm too busy trying to figure out you know what are they talking about and and you know some of the references they was making like someone said a rasengan or something like that so i think that's some kind of knife and as I started kind of piecing together, like, oh shit, they're talking about the series. They're like speaking for maybe one of the characters' perspective and shit like that. You know, I feel like a, a god, I'm sacred or something like that. By the time I got to the third verse, I felt like I kind of knew what was going on. Not really knew, but like had a, a concept of it anyway, you know, a grasp on it. And then you couple that with the fact that that guy was really going so hard on his verse. It just, I don't know, it kind of brought it together for me. And it's actually like a cool little song, you know, obviously. I don't know the replay value on it. I don't know what situation or when you would play something like this again. I mean, unless you're like a huge fan of the show, then I would understand it. Like if there's some kind of Dragon Ball Z rap or something like that, you know, that I can get into because I kind of know a little bit more of the background behind that series. I know a lot of the characters. I know a lot of the, the fighting moves and the special move that these guys do. So, and gals too, obviously. So that one, I feel like I could immerse myself in it a little bit more and kind of let go at the beginning of the song, as opposed to, you know, kind of hanging on to my seat and like, yo, what are they gonna talk about? What's going on? I see a lot of fucking anime going on in the background. All in all, pretty cool idea. I think it's a dope concept and obviously Rusty is doing his thing. He got a million subscribers on YouTube, so. When I said earlier I was looking for something obscure that nobody knew about, I mean, obviously a lot of people know about what he's doing and really appreciate what he's doing. So I appreciate it too. And you know, the creativity and just the innovation. I've never seen nothing like that before. I've seen, you know, music video cartoons or claymation or whatever, but I've never seen it done quite in this fashion, you know, where they take on the cartoon and they are uh, rapping from their perspective. So kudos to them for that, man. Shout out to those guys. Speaking of which, make sure you're going over to Rustage's YouTube page. Click on that Look At Me Now video. I think it just came out a couple of hours ago, so our timing was impeccable. Once you get there, I need you to smash that like button. And after you do that, once that like button turns blue, sign out your main account, sign into your burner account, go back to that Look At Me Now video on Rustage's page, not the Chris Brown one. Smash that like button one more time, but this time I need you to leave a little comment in the comment section for him. After you drop that comment, push in, sign out your burner account, sign back into your main account, go back to that Look At Me Now video on Rush's YouTube page, leave one more comment, but this time I need you to let them know that Ann Dollar sent you on over. Why? Because it's the right thing to do, but let's say you don't want to do it. Let's say for whatever reason, you're just not feeling it. You don't want to let them know. That's okay. You don't have to. It's not an obligation, but do take your little ass on over there anyway because the world needs to show more love. And you and I can agree that that was a pretty cool little clip that we just watched right now. Besides, the world needs to show more love anyway. So look at me now, telling you to take your ass on over there and do it pronto. All right then, y'all.